Hello Entra, this is day seven of my 90 day video challenge. I'm in the forest of Nicene Marks in Aptos, California, which is just outside of Santa Cruz. Um, something interesting about this forest is that it was severely clear cut um, in the late 1800s, uh, about 1880 to, eight, uh, to 1920. And uh, it, there's a lot of second growth. And so when they cut down the main trunk, new trees sprout from the roots all around the trunk. So there are gorgeous fairy rings of redwood trees here. I, um, I just finished reading the book, The Overstory. I don't know if you've heard of that, but um, I guess Hugh Jackman is gonna be making it into a series on Netflix. And it's a beautiful story. It won a Pulitzer Prize. Um, it's a difficult one though. Um, I found uh, the characters difficult to tell apart from one another as the storyline went along, but it's about trees and uh, being here really reminds me of that. I actually read it at first and now I'm in the process of li listening to it on Audible. So um, definitely recommend The Overstory. And uh, now I want to show you around the forest. Come on, let me show you around. This is the Twisted Grove. As you can see, the trees grow twisted. These are tiny, tiny little rose hips on a very delicate little wild rose out here. And beware of poison oak. Leaves of three, let it be. One of my favorite things about the forest is the quiet and the solitude that you get to experience out here. Ah, oh, it's just fantastic. These are little blackberries that'll be ripe later in the fall. Every ring of the tree represents a year because it grows faster during the spring and summer than it does in the winter. So you see all these little rings, if you just count them, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That, that spans about 10 years. So you're looking at, you know, several hundred year old tree here. This was one of the largest living trees here, it's called the Advocate Tree, but it fell quite a few years ago. And it's really important to leave the fallen trees on the forest floor because as the trunk decomposes, it acts as a host for a whole ecosystem of plants and animals and fungus. Here I am at the foot of the root ball. As you can see, it goes way above my head. Come on, let me take you across. And now we've come to the creek. Nate, I'm thinking of you. I'm out here huffing and puffing. I want to be able to access these beautiful places too. Ah, yes. Ah. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. We finished our adventure. I'd take a little dip and now it's sushi time. I'll see you tomorrow with another location, show you something around Santa Cruz. Not quite sure where yet, but I got some good surprises for the week.